after weeks and weeks of sadness, well technically it was like a week, but weeks and weeks of sadness, I came out with a video that my sims was no more. <laughs> and then I realized how stupid I was and I fixed it. So yeah. Welcome! <laughs> So hello everybody, welcome to episode 3 of The Sims 4 100 Baby Challenge. Was it Sim was it episode 3 or was it 4? But so we are back in the Simmer household, I think it's the Simmer household. So we are here with Ava, why is this here? But so we're currently at the saving point of when the baby has just been brought home. I'm not sure where we were up to last time if the child had aged up. I did lose a little bit of progress with my save, so I'm not sure. But if you guys have forgotten, make sure you go watch the other episodes. Or if you haven't watched the other episodes, go check them out now. But so we are here with Ava, Alexander, our toddler, our firstborn, and our baby Brandon. But so today we are going to be getting Ava pregnant, since we haven't done that in a long time because of the game issue. And we seem to have enough money, so I don't think that's too much of an issue today. We might age up Alexander. We do need to see if he's done everything he needs to. He needs to get three toddler skills up to level two. He's got communication, imagination, and potty, so he can now age up. We might age him up first. You know what? This is going to be a really, really great experience, aging up our toddler for the first time. So, can we bake a birthday cake? I have not baked a birthday cake in ages on The Sims. I'm sorry, I do not know how to play Let's make him a white cheesecake. Let's make him a white one. Otherwise, in other words, vanilla. <laughs> vanilla. Sleeping the day away. Okay, Ava, I believe in you. You can make this cake. This is the first cake you're ever, ever making. I believe in you completely. Not really, actually, God. Don't kill yourself or your kids. Last time I played, there was a fire. It wasn't our fault. I'm pretty sure it was Jeffrey's fault, our first baby's daddy. <laughs> But here's the cake. It's not broken. Okay, no one eat it. Let's add birthday candles. I think this is how it works. If Too bad if I actually age up her. So let's just save the game. I do not need Ava being an adult yet. Oh god, she's, she's a young adult right now. If she goes to adult, we have limited days with her. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! That was so cute. Oh my god. This is amazing. He's a boy! Oh, he aged, he aged up! If you guys forget, he is an angel child, which helps us out quite a lot. I think we should make him a creative kind of child. I think he's like an angel and he's really creative. I think that's kind of him. And then we have to pick a trait. Um, I kind of want him to be like, keeps to himself. I'm not sure. Let's make him an art lover. Oh, there he is! Older and wiser. Oh my god, he's such a cute kid. Oh, we'll change his clothes later because why are you wearing why are you wearing those boots? I think we might also age up the Beba. The Baba. I'm not sure if you can blow out candles. So we'll just age age them up. Okay, so they're gonna have a little birthday. I'm excited, why are you still in your hospital gown? That's kinda creepy. Oh my god! Your hair! Let's make let's make him inquisitive. <laughs> Oh my god, his hair. That is so crazy. Oh, it's cute. But, oh my god, it doesn't really fit the head, does it? I am not sure. But anyway, you need to get up because you have school soon and you need to get working on your skills. So you can work, um, so you can do your skills on the piano, Alexander, because when he goes to school, you need to get an A grade before you can become a teenager. So as soon as he's done working on the piano, he can go to sleep. Brandon is already learning skills. He is learning movement, communication, and thinking. He's already doing a good job, so I don't think we need to worry about him. Oh, no, Johnny. That's Brandon's dad. We do not need to talk to Johnny. Let's quickly check um, the family tree, because I forget our children's fathers. Okay, so it's Johnny is Brandon's dad, and then Jeffrey is... Um, Alexander. Alexander's father. So we've caught, we're up to date now. We should go grab a few rocks from the garden. Oh no, the baby's getting out. He's gonna go on the road. Oh my god, this is scary to watch. I'm a great mother. I'm just gonna dig out some rocks as my little, 
little two-year-old runs around, probably going to kill itself. You know, we're just we're just a crazy family, as you can see, playing piano at 3 a.m. Baby running around by itself, and I'm, I'm digging up rocks. This is just this is just how I live, you know. And night falls on the Simmer family. Oh wait, it's already morning. <laughs> No one got any sleep. Okay, Ava is about to wake up. So we can go and find a man. Do we know any men that we could, like, go out with? We could we could talk to Bob, but I'm not sure if Bob likes us. I think we got off to a rough start last time. Well, I'm going to call up Bob and see if he'll come. Oh, he's coming. He loves us. He's already here. Oh, look, there's another guy over here. Maybe we should also talk to him later. I don't know. Actually, we'll do that later because we want to talk to Bob first because he's at our door waiting. Our invisible door. He does not seem to like us. So we're going to have to like do a heartfelt compliment, like make him really nice. Let's get to know him. Oh my God, we can only kiss his hands. Is he like really flirty or something? Our kids are going to witness this. So this could go bad. Oh, by the way, Brandon, no, Alexander, Alexander, you can do your homework because now you have homework and now you're a boy. You're growing up. <laughs> so cute. Seems so cute. They're growing up. Bob likes us. Oh, wink, wink. Nudge, nudge. Come on, Ava. I know you can get this guy. We can ask about his career. I'm not sure what he works as, actually. Brandon's tired again. Just go to bed. Go to sleep. Sleep. There you go. See you later. Okay, well, he is, he, he works at a shop. Okay. He's in a restaurant. Pretty, pretty stable dog job. Let's go into romantic and try compliment his appearance. I'm sure this can work. Let's, uh, let's compliment his appearance one more time. A joke about ducks, because that's normal. He's very enthusiastic about us. Oh, God. Um, can we try to flirt? We're getting to that kind of point. Don't listen. Alexander, cover your ears now. Cover your ears. Tell a funny story. Oh, my God. He's willing to cheat on his wife. Okay, okay. This is getting sad. How many families are, going, are we going to break up? I love how Alexander's just doing his homework. Like, oh, happening again we got a romance bar yay he looks kind of sad let's offer him a rose it worked and we're just kind of wearing like no clothes right now so that makes it even better oh he looks like he's just staring at alexander like oh my new child awkward encounter when did that happen give relationship advice i don't know if that's a good thing to say Alrighty. oh my god he took it! Okay. I actually feel bad for um his wife. I think it's Liza. Eliza. Ask a risky question. God, it's so laggy. Ugh. Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Someone's working outside. Oh no, oh no, oh no. What's what's happening? What the heck? I think he had to go, and then she just ran outside like, no, let me kiss you. The next baby has to start with C, I think, so come on. This is not a hard task. Come on, I know you need to pee, but I don't care. No, Bob, don't leave. Oh, no, Bob, no. Bob, wait for me. Wait for me, Bob. No, no, don't talk to him. Just go to, no, don't come back. You're in your underpants. Wait, she didn't even go toilet. What? I asked her. Pee before she does it. No, Bob. Oh my god. Bob. Looks like some guy saw us when we were streaking and he is here at our door. So I guess we can invite him in with the kid because we're cooking some food for Brandon and for ourselves because we're extremely hungry. As soon as we've done this, I think we're going to invite Bob over again. She's looking very flirty while she cooks. <laughs> Otherwise, we just have to wait now. Go get your child some food. She's eating some scrambled eggs, and you're talking to probably one of my future daddies. That's great. Kids have seen too much today. <laughs> Why are you such a shady kid? Alrighty, give Brandon some food, and then we are going to call Bob back over. Because we need to get pregnant, or we're not going to be fast enough, you know? We've got to be fast. If he has work, I'm going to cry. Yay! He's Bobby, hi. We're not even going to say hello. We're just going to woohoo. I don't know why I keep getting glitches like this, like the sims, they just stop moving. Is it like a lag? I might have too much custom content. Okay, this is not PG, so if you're a young child, look away now. That was weird. I just heard the baby squeal <laughs> while this is happening. Oh god. Now, so I really like the idea of finding out that she's pregnant later, but because I don't want to go through all the effort to get Bob to come back again, we're going to take a pregnancy test before he leaves so that we know if we're pregnant or not. Oh, there was fireworks. Oh, God. We must be like a real match. 
That's kind of sad because we're not keeping Bob. We'll marry her one day when she's retired, but that won't be for a long time. Oh no, she got embarrassed because there's the boy in the bathtub and everyone's in the bathroom. I don't know. No, no. Hey. Oh God. That looks so weird. Get out of the bathroom. Yay! She's pregnant. We did it. Guess what? I met you yesterday and I'm pregnant. He's happy. Like, I don't get why they're happy. I think they need to change that. Like, if they're married or they just don't want kids, they should be like, oh, or should like be a random thing? Because I think that'd be more fun, you know? Maybe more of a storyline. I don't know. This is kind of sad. But thank you guys all for watching this episode of The Sims 4 100 Baby Challenge. Let me know if you're happy that the series is back and leave C names for this new child. That's Bob Pancakes. So that'll be great. Yeah. Cobb. Hashtag Cobb. Also leave in the comments if you made it to the end of the video. But also a cyclone is about to hit, about to hit me. So if you don't hear from me, I'm probably dead. Oh, we lost electricity. Yay! So I'm recording this as fast as I can. But I'll see you guys all in another episode. Goodbye!